of the demonstrators with the white supremacists sped into a crowd of counter protesters, killing one woman and injuring 19 others. The supremacists called themselves Republicans. It made college student Brendan Noble, who was active in the Republican Party, angry. That's not representative of the party. They were not conservative. That has nothing to do with conservative principles. There are many, many people in the Republican Party, and I'd say 99.9% .9 of them completely disagree with that. So I think it's, uh, it's a just false rhetoric to claim that they're part of the party and taking over the party at all. Republican National Committee Chair Ronna Romney McDaniel agrees. She spoke at a roundtable event at the Michigan Republican Party Detroit office. As chair of the Republican Party, it is important for me to relay to you that these groups that represent hate and bigotry and racism, that call themselves white supremacists and neo-Nazis and KKK, have no home or place in the Republican Party. This is not what the party stands for. We fight for small government. We fight for principles of being everyone being created equal. And this is not what the party was. And so I condemn everything that they were doing down there. They say they see racism not so much as a party issue, but as an American issue. Kim Russell, the Now Detroit. We have a very 